Hoosiers across the state are helping Afghan evacuees. Good evening and welcome to News 10 on My Fox 10. Indiana Governor Eric Holcomb recently announced a regional collection system of donations. This is all in an effort to get necessities to Afghan evacuees in Indiana. New for you tonight at 10, News 10's Hannah Fullman takes us to one local town and shows us how they're already making a positive impact. I'm here in Rockville, Indiana at just one of nine donation sites throughout the state. This is just one way local Hoosiers can step up and help Afghan evacuees in a meaningful way. Tens of thousands of Afghan evacuees have made their way to the United States. Members of the Indiana National Guard say several thousand evacuees are at Camp Atterbury, just outside the Wabash Valley, and they're looking for a helping hand. It's a time of need, and it's something we can do. We have the ability to help, and we're going to do everything we can to help. Sergeant Christopher McKibben is a staff sergeant at the Indiana National Guard in Rockville. He says it means a lot to him to help serve those in need, especially during a very stressful time. I'm just glad I can be doing something to help. Uh, it's one of the many missions of the Guard. It's the reason we join uh, is to help our communities and even when they're not from our community, it's still a person in need and just doing our part to help. Sergeant McKibben says this is a great way local residents can make a positive impact on the lives of many. And here's how you can help. There are a variety of items that evacuees need, but they must be new to be accepted. The donation items range from hygiene items like toothbrushes, towels, and toilet paper, to clothing items for all ages, to packaged water and non-perishable food. State leaders say 40% of the evacuees are children ages 14 and under, so many of the items in high demand are for young children, especially babies. This includes formula, diapers, and toys. But Sergeant McKibben says even one item donated will make a big difference in someone's life. I believe it helps show who we are. Uh, if we help people in need, even when though they're not our neighbors, um, it's just simple little things like a shirt or a towel or a bar of soap. It just helping another person in need. Socks and sandals are just two of the many items you can donate. For a full list of donation items and how you can help, you can visit our website. That's WTHITV.com. Reporting in Rockville, Hannah Fullman, News 10.